going for a little walk down uh, to the bridge um, I was talking about in one of my previous videos. Um, Gwen, taking Gwen today. The light's failing a bit today, so um, might not be good to film in. So, make it a quick video. And, uh, just uh, show the bridge and maybe the walk down the other way away from uh, the, uh, the Ford and Home Black. And right, just see the bridge come up now. It's uh, been a bit of damage to the road, yeah. It's, uh, let's see, this happened uh, last year in 2020, and because of all the, uh, the nonsense, uh, the council decided not to do anything about it. You know, <laughs> any other time it would be uh, an emergency, really, with the, the road started uh, collapsing away. But uh, there we go. And what they put here is uh, instead of saying that they're uh, going to come and fix it they're going to they're just saying basically if you uh, if you walk down that way there's a public footpath on there then on your head be it here's the bridge anyway uh, I can't really see it it's, um, it's actually quite a high bridge with low sides um, not really safe really. <laughs> really especially for kids because it is a really high bridge I'm probably about maybe 60 70 feet high um, I don't really want to go too close because Gwen might try and jump over. But uh, it is. But uh, there we go. Well, it, it's an old one, obviously, here from um, <coughs> the when they were bringing the silica up, I think. So, because that leads up to up there, up to uh, Slido Um That's the way we usually go, up to Pond Black, but uh, this is the other way down the river which leads to a farm that myself and my wife were interested in buying but uh, unfortunately somebody else has bought it which is a bit cutting but uh, there we go because we are self-employed both run our own businesses it's uh, yeah because of all the, the nonsense that's gone on the last two years um, it's kind of hit uh, self-employed people quite hard but uh, yeah justice will be done it will. It's getting close. Anyway, you went. Come on. Something interesting here. This uh, somebody told me to actually to try come into this part. It's getting dark again. Tried this yesterday, and it was dark yesterday as well. Um, come to this part because the old station house was under here. You can see here. There's a. It's, the, it's all concreted, and there's a place up here leading into an area, a flat area, which is all concreted again. There goes Gwen. Uh, there's a little track going down to the river over there. I won't go over there because it's, uh, it's quite steep when I don't uh, go in going down there. But this is all concreted. Um, this path that goes all the way down to Comtork from so I've stood going up there down the road and then all the way down to Turk, lower, upper Kuntur, I think it is. Uh, not sure, I have to look at that one. Oh, hang on, missed something here. In the bushes here, there's a steps, there's some old steps going up. Um, I don't know if you can quite see them. See, the light is failing a bit again. Damn. Okay. There's some steps going up and it goes up into the woods and it goes to a, um, a clearing where there are the remains of a... Uh, um, what looks like a toilet, um, <laughs> but there's obviously there, there must have been a big building there. But there's the remains of a toilet there. There's tiled walls left there. But uh, the local kids built a um, a den up there, so it's quite good actually. <laughs> but they don't go up there anymore. It's, uh, it's a shame because uh, I know this is some of the local kids like my nephew and all that. He helped build it, and uh, yeah, but they, they've all grown up now. Somebody coming down. Um, this is the. Uh, the lovely path, which, uh, as you can see, the council are maintaining really well. Um, it's part of the old railway there, there's a sleeper. And they've dug a trench all the way down the side, and the trench is actually drier than the actual path. So that's worked really, really well. So I'll walk down the trench. <laughs> they go in. What's that? What's that? 
Um, see if I can get down here before it gets a bit too dark now. Um, yeah. yeah, because the light is failing, I'm gonna have to uh, come back another day. It's, uh, I wanted to show a few things down this way. Is uh, there's another wall? Uh, see, too dark. Well, there's another wall going up here. Uh, might just be able to pick it out. I think it'll be in the station. There's the area up there. You can see the the wall in the uh, there going along there. And beyond that is where the local kids built the den and they used to. Uh, mess about in the woods. When kids go mess them out in the woods because uh, yeah. It was a lot safer than now. Uh, oh, hang on. I don't know if you can make up the shape of this. It's a structural support for a bridge that used to go across here to there. And then over the other side of that mound is the the washery for. Um, anyway, it must have been a coal washery, so because uh, yeah. And I think the way it's shaped, I'll have to show you how to go down there. That means I'll have to go past that barrier that the council put up. Um, the way it's shaped is as if there was a, a water wheel there, the way. Um, Pumwal, they call it. <laughs> Which is something wall, I don't know. It's a very simple name in uh, Wales. But uh, yeah, like I said, I'm going to have to go up there sooner or later and uh, show you the, the remains of the building that's up there. And there's remains of a. Um, uh, I think it's a base of a, uh, a crane, maybe. I'll have a. I got there, but it's getting dark now. Anyway, I'm gonna head down here, take Gwen out there, down here for an evening walk, and get back. So I'm not able to film anymore. Anyway. Ah, Gwen's going to go to the toilet. So I mean, <laughs> better clean that up. Well, as you can see, I've lost the light. Um, it, you know, it's still enough light for me to uh, get around, but uh, I won't be doing any more filming tonight. It's a shame, there's a lot of good uh, stuff done this way. You can hear Gwen splashing about in the background there, and she was. Um, but yeah, um, I'll come down here earlier on in the day and uh, I'll show you some of the, uh, the ruins of buildings and things that are up in the woods up there. Okay, right, see you next time.